No survivors! No Carter! King Valmaris orders it to be so! <sighs> so this is it. Dad, where are you? D don't be scared. You can hide behind me. Reinforcements? Damn! Dad! Sorry I'm late, baby girl. I'm so glad to see you! Milady, you're safe. Commander Noah, my comrades. What's going on? Val Morris sent a detachment to cut us off. We won't reach the ships unless we fight our way to the harbor. Duke Zaldrick must have predicted we would try to escape this way. So be it. We'll simply have to... I'll blaze a path. Uh, yes. Well, that's more or less what I was going to say anyway. Just be careful, please. To lose you would be a crushing blow to the Alliance. I think Melridge has finally given up. I'm going with you, Noah. Well, we've come this far. Might as well see it through. Hey, no fair. I'm going too. Sheesh. This wanting to meddle thing must be contagious. Good luck, everyone. We'll do our best to hold the line here. You're likely to encounter Kinani soldiers all the way to the harbor. So keep a wary eye. While you're at it, I'll assemble the troops. We'll follow as soon as you give us the signal. Go get him! We will, Alibi. We'll secure some ships and find a way to get everyone out of here. I promise. Now let's move. The storm clouds are clearing. Very well. I will continue to assist. Where's the harbor? Are we close? Should be. Once we clear a path to the ships, let's get out of here. Right. Don't let your guard down. There! It's the Alliance! Hmm. Just as we expected. Probably too much to hope they just let us waltz through. Nice monster you got there, creeps. From what I understand, it's a gift from the Empire. And what a remarkable creation it is. Sure enough. The Dukes has been predicting our every step. Doesn't matter. We still have to get through. Yeah. The others are counting on us. Now let's destroy that thing. Shall we begin?
Should be. <sighs> Not bad at all. Uh, what was it again, Lieutenant? It's Sane Kessling. You've got some impressive skills as well, Guardian Warrior. Let's keep going. We're almost at the harbor. This is fell news indeed. They... 
They sank all the ships. That must have been the Kinani Detachment's objective. Unless we make the crossing, it is only a matter of time before the Empire and Kinan have us cornered. No wonder the Dukes didn't pursue us more vigorously. He had already given the Detachment their orders. Unacceptable. This was not the plan. What happened to Operation Duke's Tears? He's probably flashing that hideous grin of his as we speak. <sighs> but it is infuriating. If he's so gifted a commander that he can read our every move, then yes, your ladyship, that is most infuriating indeed. So this is it then. The final hour. No way! I, I mean, what if we fix the ships or whatever? We can't. The Kinanis were too thorough for that. We'd be lucky to string together a single raft. Besides, the Empire would be on us long before we finished. It seems the Kinanis managed to do their job and close the escape route. Now, we need only go in for the kill. Get them. Yes, sir! Oh no, the Imperial Army. Dad, I'm scared. I don't suppose we could uh, <laughs> surrender and get off with a slap on the wrist, hmm? Anyone? No? Okay, no. We could rally our troops and make a stand, but the odds are firmly stacked against us. So there's nothing we can do? <sighs> Noah? <sighs> I'll go. What? Uh, no, just wait! It's my head they want. If I turn myself in, they... Listen to yourself. That's not meddling. It's just stupidity. Don't you dare. Seriously, wait! Do you really think turning yourself in will protect us somehow? Wait, guys! Guys, wait! Well, I haven't heard any other workable ideas. No, really, wait! These guys are terrible people. They'll probably kill you on the spot and then come for us anyway. We should run at them. Fight like demons. It might work. Would everybody just listen already? I suppose we could try surrendering collectively. Huh. I suppose that's one way to go. Would you please just... Shut up and listen! Sheesh, Leanne. You don't have to yell. Apparently I do, because you've all got mud in your dang ears. Now listen! Uh... She's right. Everyone be quiet. Someone's singing? I'll be trying, lass, but this ain't as easy as navigating the sand. Yo, be it safe to be sailing out here on all this briny blue? Hold fast, lads. If ye fall in, it'll melt your bones. Great sea arc in the sky. I'm too young to dissolve. I wanna die on the sand. Stop your blabbering. Be ye men or be ye sharks? Our lives are a small price to pay to be saving our friends. Ain't that right? That's you, Lynn. And the sharks. Gosh, just look at all the ships. Poor baby. Does this mean. Looks like you get to keep your head attached to your shoulders for another day.
for an old castle. The blasted thing is stubbornly built. Took me ages to rust the door. Now then. My name is Chapel Winlart, and I am your newly appointed governor by decree of the Galdean Empire. I give you this proclamation. Henceforth, this city shall be known as Eastlert. The old name is hereby abolished, and any refusing to use the proper name will face swift punishment. Be silent! Your civic status in the Empire shall be second class, with the exception of the Betailed, who shall be third class. Be silent! I will not say it again! Fortunately for you wretches, His Grace Dukes Aldrich is both merciful and generous. Any who possess or is attuned to a rune lens will be awarded the rights of a first-class citizen and fast-tracked as a potential officer in the Imperial Army. This is, I assure you, a very lucrative offer. If you believe you are eligible, present yourself at the Governor's office post-haste. Morning. Uh, everyone's gathered in the Great Hall, and, um... Um... Well, I just wanted to come spread a little cheer. You know me, I've got cheer on tap, free of charge. So, let's go! 